what do you think I am at? Aren't I supposed to have any patience to reach the end of mother? I know. I know it seems unimportant to you. What I am doing. What I want to do. Having a little difference between them. But you don't get it. Listen. You think I am crazy about the warehouse? You think I want to spend 55 years down there in that cellotex interior with fluorescent tubes? Look. I'd rather somebody picked up a crowbar and battered out my brains than go back mornings. I go. Every time you come in yelling that got a rise and shine, rise and shine, I say to myself how lucky dead people are. But I get up. I go. For $65 a month, I give up all that I dream of doing and being ever. And you say self. Self is all I ever think of. Why listen? If self is what I thought of mother, then I'd be where he is. Gone. As far as the system of transportation reaches. I'm going to the movies. You don't believe me. Okay. I'm going to opium dens. Yes, opium dens. Dens of vice and criminal hangouts, mother. I've joined the Hogan gang. I'm a hired assassin. I carry a Tommy gun in a violin case. I run a string of cat houses in the valley. They call me Killer. Killer Wingfield. I'm leading a double life. I'm a simple, honest warehouse worker by day and by night, a dynamic czar of the underworld, mother. I go to gambling casinos. I spin away fortunes on the roulette table. I wear a patch on one eye and a false mustache. And sometimes I put on green whiskers. And on those occasions, they call me El Diablo. <laughs> oh, I could tell you things that could make you sleepless. My enemies, they plan to dynamite this place. They are gonna blow us up sky high some night and I'll be glad. Very happy. So will you. As you go up, up on a broomstick over Blue Mountain with 17 gentlemen call us you ugly, babbling old witch.